Hey everybody, welcome back to Ready Steady Play. We're playing Clank. Mm-hmm. And uh, it's Graham's turn. It is. Um, I have decided that since Vicky is super pissed, and I have a whole bunch of my cubes in that bag, then I should <laughs> probably leave before I get roasted alive. So, let's see how we do it. Not great. Not great at all. We're going to stumble a little bit, adding some more clank. <laughs> Oops. Oopsie. Then we're going to pay our black market goblin type fellow seven gold, which I have here, to get me two oh, secret gems. We've stumbled again. <laughs> <laughs> of course we did. Let's see what we got. Coin purse. Uh-huh. That's worth money. We've got Treasure Hunter, a companion. Replace a card in the dungeon row. She looks cool. She does look cool. Digging her style. And the Juke is back. <laughs> this guy is less cool. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? What? He's a gold digger. <laughs> he blatantly is. <laughs> right. Seven gold. Gets me two secret tomes. All the secrets will be mine. Uh, and then, once again, I'm going to steal a whole bunch of crap. Buggle, buggle, buggle. Netting me three skill points, which isn't as much as I've become used to. <laughs> Replace a card in the dungeon, though. Ooh. All right. Let's have another look around. Treasure Hunter. Yeah. I'll, I'll dig her star. I'll get a Treasure Hunter. Excellent. Nice. All right. Before we forget this time. Yeah. Our next card is Sneak. Minus two clank. Mm. All right. So what have I got going on here? I don't think I even looked at this. Oh, wow. Wow, indeed. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I've got um, a mercenary, another mercenary, and three burgles. <laughs> <laughs> You're just punching and stealing stuff. My way through the crystal caves. Okay, so I've got four swords. Um, so I think I'll just defeat this ogre for five gold. If I may. You may. Yeah, excellent. Uh, which leaves me with one sword left over, with which I can do nothing useful. And then I've got five... five uh, Skilly points. Skill points. Now, I quite want that sneak. That sneak does look useful. Yeah, but if I buy that, I can't really get anything else useful. You could get an ex explore. But I could have a coin purse worth so much money. <laughs> but I need to get out of here, and that has movement on it. <laughs> and I'm very worried about you hightailing it out of here and leaving me. That is to what die I did last time. <laughs> in the depths. I am known to do this. <laughs> so I think I'll take the sneak and an explore. <laughs> I think this is wise. <laughs> Okay, so we've got oh, yep, yep. Wand of Recall. If you have an artifact, teleport to an adjacent room. That's mm -hmm. very good. That is useful, seeing as we both have artifacts. And here's your friend the Watcher. Yes. So this is the guy who last game I would constantly beat the crap out of to generate Clank for Mike here. <laughs> you killed, I think, three or four of them. Yep. And it worked out very well. <laughs> okay. So, start of my turn, I will play the Black Pearl, uh, discarding a burgle to draw two more cards. Uh -huh. I right. can't believe how few dragon attacks we've had. We've been really lucky. Yeah, but that just makes me think that there's more coming. There's more coming. Vicky's not going to stand for the shit. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, then I'll play my sneakers, my elven boots, to draw a card. Oh, this movement is great. <laughs> <laughs> I'll play an explore to get me the two movement I need to get up into this cave. Oh, but now I can't move anymore, can I? So all this movement's just wasted. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> you've, you've overdone it. You've overexerted um, yourself. Yeah. Oh, well. 
Well, I'll kind of move silently within the crystal cave, <laughs> uh, getting rid of this clank here. Then I'll explore the cave a little bit more, <laughs> and then steal some stuff. So, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven skill points this turn. Uh, which will get me... You know what? Since I'm leaving, and I want lots of points before I do, I'm going to get a secret tome. Getting me another seven victory points when I eventually get out of here. Sweet! Outrageous. Also, it does not pull more cards out of the dungeon deck, which decreases chances of dragon attack. What you looking up there? Um, I wanted to uh, check the or I wanted to know if I could uh, go into that market, buy a backpack, and then pick up the artifact. I can't think of any reason why you wouldn't be. Able I can't because I've got to pick up the artifact when I move into the room. Oh, could you not go into that space, get a backpack, move out? Oh, you'd have to then move out and then move back in. Yeah, is that what you're saying? Right. Okay. Unfortunately. Hmm. Well, I'll start off by playing Stumble, because there's no avoiding it. I've <laughs> tripped and fallen, and made some noise. Hmm. Oops. The vase does look very shiny. It's probably got some ghostly spirits inside. <laughs> oh god, you're just gonna get out of here, and I'm just gonna be <laughs> in so much trouble. <laughs> Um, I don't know. I'm only on two damage. I might stick around a bit. I'm definitely visiting <laughs> that market. Well, that's interesting. Well, I'm Actually, going to. Uh, I don't have any money. Why am I? Why am I going to visit that market? <laughs> well, there's a secret. Okay, no, no, the secret. The secret's there. So that's good. I'm going to uh, scramble. I'm going to go down into this market. Uh huh. Where I'm going to buy something shiny. We have beautiful wares, sir. I think... I think I'm going to purchase the backpack. Aha. I see your game. That's... I need those other two, sir. Don't shortchange me now. Oh yeah, it's seven, <laughs> isn't it? Dear God. <laughs> All right, then I'm going to play the Cleric of the Sun, who gives me a sword, and my Mermaid, who gives me another boot, which will allow me to move down into the Crystal Cave here without taking a damage from the monster icon. And now I have to stop, so I'll just throw down a Burgle for six. Hmm. See, you're getting a lot of points, so maybe I don't want to leave. The, the, this, well, here. this is my only hope. I've got to try and rack up enough points to disincentivize <laughs> you from just fleeing. <laughs> it's working. I am definitely <laughs> rethinking just leaving now. Um, so, for six... Do you know what? I really like this Wand of Recall, which lets me teleport, which might just help me escape at some yeah. point. I think I'll also take this lucky coin, because I've got the money. Nice. All right, so let's see. Dun dun, what's in the dungeon? Another Cleric of the Sun. Great. Hey, Kara. And, and a boomerang. Whoa. When you discard this, return it to your hand. Wait, what? Can you just keep playing that? No, I think it's like, uh, I think discard is not... Discarding stuff uh, from the, I think it's like it's when from you just, the play area. Like when you discard it with like a um another card, you know. Oh, like, as in the the card you've been using to discard stumbles. Exactly. You can discard the boomerang. I just get it back. Okay, cool. We have, you know, quite cautiously got a very uh nice dungeon set so far. <laughs> like you know, I'm aware that this has been quite kind to us. <laughs> it has indeed. Yeah. Large lack of dragon attacks. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. 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 All right. So I'm going to be 
trailblazing yet again. So we're sidestepping to start us off. Boop. Get the secret. Which is... Oh. Oh, it's a trash -a card. I don't want a trash -a card. All these cards are really good. Do I have to do that immediately? Um, this has the answer. It says... At the end of the turn. Alright. At the end of the turn, trash right. a card from your discard pile or play area. And then return that token to the... How come you got all the cool trashes? I didn't get any. But they're not helping me because I, ne <laughs> I never have a stumble when it happens. <laughs> right. We'll My cards are too good. <laughs> <laughs> Luxury problems. Yeah. <laughs> um... Going to play my Elven Boots to draw a card. Hopefully I get a trash card here. There we go. All right, we can get rid of that. Uh, then, like, okay, so that's another move. I'm not going to go up into that cave because I want to actually use all this move I've got. So I'm going to risk it for a biscuit. Go through here without defeating the monster. So I'll take a damage. Then... The, that room up there heals you, by the way. It does, doesn't it? But it doesn't have treasure. <laughs> so I'm not interested. <laughs> uh, actually, or am I? You know what? I am interested. I'm going to have to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Actually, let me think about this. No pressure. It's just, you know... Your life hanging okay. in the balance. <laughs> <laughs> We're not going for that. We're risking it for more biscuits. Another move takes me over here. Then a move silently will take me down here whilst negating that clank. Yeah. As you dive into the water again. As I dive back into the water, getting me ooh, a healing potion. A healing potion, which I will just use and heal another wound. Well, I didn't, I didn't heal that wound. Healing a wound that I foolishly refused to do earlier. <laughs> uh, then I will explore, which gets me the one more movement I need to go over here. Why uh, one? Don't you need two through there? Well, I had a leftover one from the move silently. Got it. Uh, and then let's do a little bit of burglary, just a little bit. So you're holding your breath this turn. I am. What that means is if you don't come out of the water next turn, at least once, mm -hmm. uh, you'll, you'll take a damage from suffocation. <laughs> then again, yeah. what's one damage, right? <laughs> I know, right? I obviously thought this through. Uh, for skill points today, I have four. Uh, this is the card I will be trashing at the end of my turn. So with four, I'm going to get... I'm going to waste one and get the Cleric of the Sun for three. But as I acquire her, she will be very kind and heal me a damage. Nice. Awesome. Oh, wait, that bird was getting trashed. <laughs> and we've got a dragon shrine. Oh, boy. Danger, plus one cube for all dragon attacks. Oh, God. That's six Ooh. cubes coming out each. Use trash a card in your play area or discard pile. Ooh. That's nice. I quite like that. I don't like that. I got great cards. <laughs> <laughs> I have a big fat deck of shit. <laughs> <laughs> so with that... With that uh, dragon shrine here making everything even more interesting, six cubes. Six. If she wow. rages up. On the other hand, we have been really lucky. I yeah. Feel. Like last game, it was like dragon attack, dragon attack, dragon attack. And this time, it's just been like nope. fairly plain sailing. I mean, she's got all this rage inside her that she can't <laughs> let out, apparently. <laughs> She's just letting it boil, which yeah, means when I it... feel like any day now, it's just going to be like... <laughs> when it does come out. A murder storm. <laughs> it's going to be apocalyptic. Well, we'll have to find out if the apocalypse comes around <laughs> tomorrow on Ready Steady Play. So if you're enjoying the series, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you all there. See you.